What's good with y'all? What's good? What's good? y'all what's good what's good we tuning in for another video man today we got some running around to do uh for right now i'm finna head to summit to uh pick up the fans for john jones and i gotta go take the expensive shifter back man i got it out the car uh got it out big dolo so i gotta take that back and get back in time i need to go and do all that little knickknack stuff the power stirring power stirring belt and Really finna bolt the shelter down. But I'm gonna hit my friend Rick. See if he can get by here for a split second. Or after he get off. Call man, it'd be dark when he get off. But I'm gonna see if he can get off by for a well, if he can swing by for a split second so we can run them bolts down through there and all that. And you know, make it do what it do. So uh let me hit that road. Y'all stay. So we back. Well been back at the house. Finna leave again. Y'all see it uh didn't get, a time, didn't get time to meet with Big Dolo car. I had other business to tend to. So, we about to go ahead and head to Joe Buddy Race. Because, um, I should be about getting to the shop. I need to get some gas right quick, too. Some racing gas. Y'all know my monthly supply I always get. So, I'm finna go do that. Catch them before they close. And, look, we finally got it finished. We're gonna get a couple more Chris Marie's. But, oh, and two more inflatables. Over there to fill it out, but got the icicles up there on the top, right there, and down there. So it be lit up, boy. It be lit up at night. I love it, man. Kid love it. Snap, man. Got to be in the Christmas spirit. And I'm been thinking about what I'm gonna do when it comes to giving back. But whatever it is, I'm gonna do something. I best believe that. So. I'm put the fire stick up. I'm gonna show y'all the fans. That's why I got y'all on, man. I ain't, I ain't got y'all on just to be tumbling y'all around. But we got the fans from Summit. Two of these guys. I, I, I cracked one open a little bit and peeked at it. But I don't know when I get to the shop, man. We'll take them out. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of kind of curious on if these things gonna fit. But we got these two right there. I'll take them out we get to the shop. But for now, let's hit the road. I gotta cut y'all off so I can get to the place in time to get me some race gas. So let me hear I'm trying to get back. I didn't know you was gonna come on out here. Yeah, I can't I see it too. Oh yeah. Alright, y'all, we it's take it in. Or just one it's two on, but that's why I said keep the boxes just in case cause these they slightly bigger. Yeah. Di in diameter car the one. I, like I was telling y'all, the one we got on there already, they, man, they, they talking about next year. Next year? Next year. I said, we need them. Okay. We need okay. them now. So, we got these fan, the unk, man, he out here hey, taking the loose on this. At the new plane. Yeah. <laughs> I'm out here where the new plane going to be. They're going to be the holy ground for Joe Buddy Racing. Yeah, man. That unk, unk spot, he been had the land for a little second. Got it all laid out. I ain't been out here in a minute. He got it all laid out. When I came out here, y'all, it was all tree, man. We were riding dirt bike. Yeah. Well, they were riding dirt bike. Not me. <laughs> I said they were riding dirt bike, but yeah. like they, they. Yeah, I think I'll put a driveway down there too. Right here. Yeah, yeah you can come in. Put a driveway in. going to the backside of it. Yeah, man. Like, like he, so we got slab pulled already. I seen that. Yeah, they I remember. Build it. Yeah. Build the car. It's then gonna be on. We're gonna lay the parking lot, and we're gonna have a test pad. Yeah, that tip. pad. You have a 180 tip pad. I'll, I'll tell you, look, he yeah. got plenty of spade now. So y'all see it. The the uh, future grounds of Joe Buddy Racing. Yes, sir. It's coming, man. Y'all see the pad out there. It hey, is hey, coming. Jay, the, the country going to see us again. We used to race out here. Yeah, exactly. It's going to be our street race spot. <laughs> we going to, hey, we coming back. We back. We're going to be back out here, boy. I'm talking about 
Then y'all look, it ain't it ain't nothing. It ain't nobody ran right here in this little strip and stuff. Never. It's it, a solar panel field on the right from here, and a power plant on the left from here. Right, right. So it's like you ain't got too much to worry about. I mean, well you got traffic booming right now, but yeah, they slow down. I think people trying to get home from work. Yeah, that's what it is. But that'll be fine. That'll be their most uh, being the for Joe Biden. Most definitely, most definitely, people be seen. Yeah. So it still be seen, but y'all see it, man. You got a good little spot. Perfect. Been making moves. That's what I told y'all. Been asking about him. We been making moves, man. Been making moves, but y'all see it coming. The building gonna be up. It ain't gonna go down, y'all. So y'all just stay tuned in. All right, y'all. We back at the house, man. From topping up with Unc and all that. I thought we were gonna catch y'all. Take y'all to the shop. Unc back in the old shop right now, but. Uh, he was trying to get some parts off somebody. They wanted to buy some parts or something like that. So that's why he was out there on the land. But y'all got to see the new spot uh, where Joe Buddy Racing going to uh, permanently be. So, you know, I already picked up me some more fuel fragrance. I love this stuff, man. I keep this stuff now. I keep this stuff, man. That good. It's cologne for real now. Real cologne. Y'all see I got one right there. They're really wifey. But I be using mine, man. I be they go one on the floor I need to get. But uh I gotta keep them now. I really just put them in brown coat. Got the gas. We got the uh 15 gallons. I got two 112 octane and one 114. Like I said, when I want to mix down with 93 on um, sometime. I just I keep it mixed at least all the time now. Late at least lately, car I've been going to track. And uh, I didn't want pure 93, even if I'm running no motor. Now, when the truck, when the truck went to Middle Georgia last time, it was on pure 93. Cause I just I ain't had time. I had so much gas in it, it was like a full tank of gas, and I had drove it enough. Now Dolo, I don't keep Dolo on full unless I know I'm not gonna be going to the track for a couple of weeks or something, and I fill it completely up. But when I'm ready to go to the track, I like to have racing gas in there. And all of that but we got the fans um i really want to see what the verdict gonna be if they're gonna be too big for both of them but either way i'm gonna have at least one on going and uh if i have to run the one big fan i'll do that but what i might end up doing like i said is standing the radiator up running a bigger radiator and standing it up and getting new lines extending all that and i have a lot more clearance than tilting the radiator like they do from the factory but i got to have that car ready the car got to be ready by this weekend because i told you i got some major going on and i got to have it ready which like y'all see later what it is but i got to have it ready gotta have all them ready so tomorrow i think we're gonna go ahead and be turning some wrenches man we got stuff everywhere man these old these christmas boxes they'll be out of here car cover it's everything but anyway got my converter for meat well, that converter go with the big block. Ain't nobody, nobody still ain't bought the big block yet. People playing around, so I'm gonna tell folk what's about to happen with the big block. I'm about to take it out. I'm about to go ahead and take it out, cause I see how this going. People playing around, just like when I was trying to sell Dolo the chassis, the roller, so I put the car back together. And now it is what it is today. So I'm gonna take the big block apart myself here at the house. I'm gonna take it out. I'm gonna take it apart, inspect it, everything. Boom, boom. I'm going to put it back together. It's going to be a fresh engine, and then the price going to be more. Telling people right now, I try to tell people, big block for sale. But I want to make no move. Everybody playing around. So then I am going to say when I put it back together, it's going to be at least $10,000. It's going to be a fresh engine. It's going to be $10,000. It's a fresh proven engine. JBR Combo. It's a fresh proven engine. It done ran the numbers. It has done it. Ain't no speculation. Like it ran the number. It has done what it does. So that's what I'm gonna do. So y'all can look forward to that. I'm gonna be pulling the engine out of um Big Meat this week. That was on my agenda. And then I'm finna go ahead and get this pile out of the way, cause they wipe and stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and tomorrow cause I was thinking, I said, man, no wonder the heat don't blow hot. The heat of course not in the car. It bypassed right now. So tomorrow I'm gonna go ahead and Put the heater core, evaporator dry, all that stuff in. It ain't hard. It's just a little tedious. It's just a tedious task. That's all it is. So tomorrow, get all this stuff out the box. Go ahead and get out of the way and do that. 
And we got her uh not evaporated condenser over there. All that stuff, which I gotta take the radiator out. But the heater core going in tomorrow, or I'm gonna pull the engine out of Meach tomorrow. So either way, we're turning some wrenches because we're gonna have some good weather. And I got to get ready. I'm gonna give y'all some good content. And I got to get ready uh, for the weekend. Gotta get the car ready. And I ain't forgot, today is, I got one more day. I'm gonna give y'all the double upload, man. I told y'all for the month over. Can y'all double upload and today y'all looking at this might be the day so y'all just stay tuned but that's it man i appreciate y'all i'm gonna catch y'all later bcg we out